What's up guys, NBA is back and we're looking at some more NBA player props in today's video. This video does apply to apps like Prize Picks and Sleeper, but also sports books like DraftKings. So we're going to hop in and hopefully get some more winners today. Our run currently is 12 and 3 in these YouTube videos. We've been absolutely on fire. We've cashed all of our last three player props as well. So looking to dive right back into the NBA and hopefully catch some more winners. Before we do so though, make sure you guys check out the Dub Club. The Dub Club, you guys can get with the link down my description below because there's a two-day free trial. Make sure you guys go ahead and join right now because it's two days completely for free. You guys can join the Dub Club and see what it's all about. My price picks left him at winnings over $5,700. That is straight profit right there, by the way. Not the amount one or anything like that. That's just straight up profit from prize picks, as you guys can see right there. Over $5,700 in about two years, starting out with about 100 bucks in my prize picks account. But if you don't know what Dub Club is, it is a messaging service that sends all the plays that I make straight to your phone through the Dub Club app, email, Telegram, or Discord. I send my plays out to over 2.3 thousand subscribers and for a bunch of different sports, including the NBA, NHL, MLB, and the NFL. Spring training is back today, so there's, po there's a possibility I end up posting some MLB player props really, really soon here. And also, the regular season starts on, on uh, March 30th, which is amazing. It's, it's my best sport, tied with the NBA. So I'm super excited about MLB being back. So a lot of big things going on in the Dub Club. Some massive runs that we've been having. We are catching so many wins. You guys can see right there that I'm reputable. And why not check it out for yourself? Two-day free trial down in my description below. Also, if you guys are not on the app Sleeper, make sure you guys go ahead and check it out. This app is awesome. You guys can get it for yourself. Link is down in my description below. Make sure you guys use that promo code DUMG. That will get your first deposit matched all the way up to $500 right now. On top of that, we're also going to have a huge Luka discount today on Sleeper. It's going to be bumped down from 31 and a half. Uh, and depending on how many retweets it gets on Twitter, it can go down all the way to half a point. It'll probably be like... I don't know, 15 points ish today. Who knows? But make sure you guys go and check out Sleeper for yourself. It's an amazing app, in my opinion. I use it for all my player props, pretty much. I mean, all the lines that I post in today's video, by the way, will be available over on Sleepers. Make sure you guys check out for yourself. Link is down in my description below. Again, use that promo code DUMG. We're going to get into what you guys have been waiting for the player props. Just make sure you guys play responsibly and at your own risk. Subscribe to the channel and leave a like. I really would appreciate it. And have those post notifications turned on so you guys do not miss future uploads when I post new videos. And you guys can get these plays for completely free. So let's go ahead, though, and just hop into player prep number one. The first player prop that I like today is going to be Luka Doncic over 31 and a half points today. Dub Club was able to get him at 30 and a half and 31, but now he's up to 31 and a half, but I still like Luka today over 31 and a half. Let's take a look at why I like him today over on the props.cash tool. So on props.cash, we can see here that Luka is over in 64% of games so far this year. How's he been though against the Suns in the past? He's over in all of these games against the Suns, except for one where he only saw like, I don't know, like four minutes in that game. He only had like one field goal attempt. So not really counting that one. He's over. He's just cleared this line every time pretty much against the Suns. And that's because he has a lot of motivation today against Devin Booker. If you know a little bit about the NBA, Luka and uh, Devin Booker don't really like each other. So that kind of gives them both some uh, motivation to do pretty well today. And I think Luka is going to be one to get the uh, upper hand today, I think. So this game also is a one and a half point spread. It's expected to stay close. And I think Luka should have a pretty good game here. Take a look at his last few games here and it kind of what his field attempts are like. He's had 16 plus in most of these games, but really 20 plus in most of these. Uh, I expect that today. I mean, you know, against Phoenix in the past, he's had 20 plus field goal attempts in all those games. So I'm expecting about 20 or more field goal attempts here because he's also had 20 plus in seven of his last 10 games there. So in games where he sees 20 plus field goal attempts, that goes all the way up to 78% hit rate. So he's been even better when he has those uh, 20 plus field goal attempts, obviously. He does typically play a little bit better at home as well, which he will be at home today. But uh, yeah, he should be in a really, really nice spot, I think. If for whatever reason you guys want to see how he's been on a Thursday, uh, he's, he's two for two this year on Thursdays. He's had 39 points in back to back games on a Thursday. So I mean, take that how you will. Not really an actual stat point there, but it's just a really simple breakdown. He's been great when he sees the field goal attempts. I expect him to be aggressive today against Devin Booker and uh, I expect Luka to be in a pretty solid spot. I mean, you're really, um, you're not really in too bad of a spot when you're taking Luka overs. Uh, so I'm really looking spot today for Luka. I think he should be aggressive today. So it's uh, my first player prep there, Luka over 31 and a half points. If you like this tool that I'm using right now, by the way, it's called props.cash and get it for yourself. Link is down my description below, promo code DUMG. and get you guys 25% off of your first month. Again, promo code DUMG. It's only gonna be $15 for your first month. You guys get a research tool that comes with all these different sports and it's just amazing. I, I've seriously used this tool for over two years now and I would not change to anything else. This is how I research my player props every single day. I've been using it every single day for two years now. So if you guys want to research player props like me, check out props.cash, promo code DMG, get you guys 25% off. Now taking a look at player prop number two, let's look at Jaden Ivey over 17 and a half points today. I really like Ivey here over 17 and a half points. Let's take a look at why though. So back to props.cash here, Jaden Ivey, he's over in 40% of games so far this year, but of course has been a little bit better as of late. A lot of these games, however, were without Cade Cunningham, I will say, but in games with Cade Cunningham, the hit rate does go down and just a little bit here, but still he's kind of stayed aggressive here. 
Did include his field goal attempts as of late. He's had a lot of games with 12, 16, 21 field goal attempts, especially as of late, like since February. His minutes have been trending up as well, except for the game where I think he got hurt, I think, against Phoenix there, um, which wasn't a major injury or anything like that. But he should be seeing 28 plus minutes today. When he sees 28 plus minutes, he has been a lot better. Uh, if you guys look at his hit rate, he's over in 43%, which is an increase uh, compared to before. He's had a pretty good history against Indiana, by the way, even with Kid Cunningham being there. He's had 25 and 18 points in those two games when he sees those 28 plus minutes. Uh, so he's been very, very good against them for sure. Uh, so I'm expecting that to kind of stay the same here. I believe there's also a little bit of beef too uh, between uh, Jaden Ivey and I believe Benedict Matherin. So that could be a little bit of a uh, boost there for Jaden Ivey today as well. So that's another reason why I kind of took this player prop. But overall, I'm really what I'm really hoping for today is that Jaden Ivey goes back to that aggression here and sees those 12 plus field goal attempts. I mean, this game here against New York, or I'm sorry, not in New York, uh, Phoenix there, he had six field goal attempts there in only like, what, 14 minutes? So, I mean, he really should have saw, again, 12 or more field goal attempts there if he played his full minutes. So, in games where he sees 12 plus field goal attempts, by the way, he's over in 63% of games, and that is with Kid Cunningham. That's not even games without Kid Cunningham. Without Kid Cunningham, he's over in 72%. So, love the spot for Jaden Ivey. He just has shoot well. He's had quite a few games, too, where, just, where it's just bad shooting. I mean, if you take a look games where he shoots 35% or better, it does go up quite a bit. I mean, you can see right there, it goes up to 86% hit rate. So, as long as he doesn't, you know, just as long as he doesn't shoot completely terrible, I think he should be in a great spot today, or unless his field goal attempts drop off, that's maybe a way that he loses, but... I think he's going to go back to those 12 plus field goal attempts today. I think there's a shot for him to be even more aggressive against Benedict Matherin. I think that Jaden Ivey should be in a uh, really nice spot today against the Pacers, who he's been pretty good against in the past. As you guys can see right there, he's over in both games so far this year and three of his last four. And the only time he missed right there was uh, on the hook there. So love Jaden Ivey today as well as Luca. Those are my two player props that I'm rocking with. Hopefully you guys did enjoy today's video and hopefully catch some more winners today. Like I said earlier, you guys can see all the player props that I'm playing today over in the Dub Club with a two-day free trial. Go get in. It's two days completely for free. If you guys like it, stick around. Otherwise, just go ahead and cancel it. Uh, not really any risk there. The two player props I like today, Luka Doncic over 31 and a half points. And the second player prop that I like is going to be Jaden Ivey over 17 and a half points. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys in the Dub Club and also in tomorrow's video. Peace out. Thank you guys for watching. Let's catch more winners and prove that run to 14 and 3.